Yo, what's going on, PokeChamp? So this is your boy from his channel. We're back with another Pokemon Journeys reaction. Reacting to Pokemon Journeys episode 98. Another Chloe-focused episode. So we'll get to see Chloe, Evie, the circus, Ash, and Go, and participating in some kind of performance or event. I'm really intrigued. This seems like another chill episode because next week we're getting the Ash versus Marnie episode. And I am hyped to see Grimmsnarl on the screen. My second favorite Pokemon of all time is on the screen finally. I can't wait to see it, but today is an Eevee-focused episode, so let's go ahead and dive onto this episode because I'm excited to see what they have to offer as far as, you know, more Chloe is good to see. So let's just go ahead and dive into it. Yo, the Pokemon Circus. Did they always have a Pokemon Circus or is this something new to Journeys? I'm a little confused. I don't know. I don't remember them always having a Pokemon Circus, though. Oh, Ash and Go were chosen by a lottery and they actually got free tickets. That's pretty dope. That's actually pretty cool. So Evie, and it looks like some girl performer. Uh, let's take a look. Okay, they're doing the whole, I don't know. I'm not much of a circus guy, just not my thing. But they're doing the whole thing and grab your let. How does she hop off so smooth? Ayo, he's got his Evie too. Okay, he's dressed in the yellow. She's dressed in like the orangey red. Okay, it's looking pretty good. Oh, it's starting, okay. The circus, the circus. What do they have to offer? The main performer guy, the showman. I'm guessing is what they're called. I, again, circuses are not my thing. Oh, okay. So they're about to evolve their Eevees. So this is the whole Koharu Eevee side of the episode. Interesting. Well, let's see how it goes. I mean, we know Flareon, we know Jolteon. We know what these Pokemon are like from previous series. He loves electric types, and this is his partner, Rhyme. I like Rhyme. Rhyme's a pretty dope name. Interesting. I like that. They're going back and forth on what's better, fire or electric type. Both typings are pretty cool. I will add that. Ah, uh, okay, so there's stones are already with them. So all they have to do is give it to the Pokemon. Thunderstone and Firestone, real simple. Real simple, very classic stone situation to evolve the Pokemon. Super cool. Oh no! They tapped him with the wrong ones! No! Dang, that really sucks. Now, the fire girl, Honoka, right? Honoka? She has the Jolteon and Billy has the Flareon and they wanted the other. Oh, that sucks! Oh, that sucks so much! Oh, that's so, oh, that's garbage. I'd be so upset. I'd be, I'd be furious. Doesn't work that way. You can't use the stones to, again, to hope they would change. It just doesn't work that way. Once an evolution is set, it's set. That's it. Ah, uh, look at them being mature. So they're going to switch partner Pokemon just for the show. And I guess they'll try to handle the rest of it off screen. That's kind of crazy. Okay, looks like Ash and Go are doing their thing. For a little bit of uh, you know, show power. He was in Thunderbolt on the on this thing. Is he gonna catch it? Ooh, did not catch it and shocked himself. Oh my goodness, Ash, you are not a performer. Hey yo, whoa! Okay, he's using branch poke. Isn't that technically the first time that Grookey's ever used a Pokemon move? Like a like his own physical Pokemon move? That's actually really cool to see. Hold on. Ayo, fire team, let's go. Litleo, Dermaka, and Torchic. Three good fire Pokemon. I like that. Ooh, what? You're not fire. A Thunder Team, Ellie Kid, Shinx, and a Helioptile, right? Helioptile? Like I said, I, I think a combination of fire and... and Lightning could work so well, like just the coordinator, I guess, mindset of watching like May and Dawn back in the past. I think it could fit really well. Interesting. So it looks like if they're going to use electricity, the fire doesn't really help. Or sorry, the fire helps, but electricity does it because it catches the whole thing on fire. And you can't grab that. You can't grab that. But that it's just not going to work. You burn yourself or you shock yourself. So it seems like a lose-lose situation here. They both need a moment. Understandable, man. This is, uh, it's not easy stuff, but it looks like the Eevees are off to go do something. 
And of course, Koharu has to be there to help the, the status of the whole situation. So I'm guessing the Eevees might teach each other what they need to do, right? I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Okay, Eevee with the copycat. I'm guessing it's gonna use Ember here. Yep, used Ember. So that could always be another option. And he uses a copycat again to then use what? Thunder Shock? I'm guessing it was, that's what that is. Yeah. Look, both the Eevees are stunned, or Eeveelutions are stunned by this. Okay, okay. They're working together like really well. And then Eevee is hitting both of them with both Thunder Shock and Ember. That's interesting. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. Um. Oh, whoa, combination pops off a firework. Okay, I like where this is going. It reminds me of Contest, and it's, it's actually really cool to see. I never really cared about Contest in the past, but this is really cool to see first hand since it's been so long. A hey, special guest, Ash and Pikachu, Go and Grookey. Let's see, how do they kick off the uh, circus here? I'm actually excited to see it. Go and Ash look goofy. Oh, come, Court Jester Pikachu. Come on, bro. Okay, okay, Ash, saucy. He's saucy, he was whipping it up. He was doing his thing, he was whipping it up. Okay, hit it with the Thunderbolt. Come on, Ash, you got it. You have to catch it, right? Oh my goodness. My boy, my boy Go is twirling that. I can't believe Grookey's using a move right now. I'm blown away. Tapping the hell out the ground, hello? Ooh, let's see it, let's see it. Come on, you gotta catch it, guys. Make it happen. Ooh, with such finesse. Hey, Koharu and Eevee, she looks great. Honestly, she seems almost at home, but I'm kind of hoping this is not her future profession. But it would be interesting, but very short-lived, because I don't see how you do this much outside of, you know, standard stuff, but okay. Got the Flareon, got the Jolteon. Make it happen. Ooh. Oh, they're just trading them like that? Oh my goodness. Got the flames, got the shocks. Then we got the electric and the fire going up in the air and the additional fireworks. Okay. This is looking kind of good, actually. Oh, snap. They're giving her a Thunderstone or a Firestone. Doesn't she also have a Waterstone, too? Man, she's getting the options to evolve this Eevee however they, or it wants to evolve, I guess. Aw, uh, isn't that cute? Another Chloe, Koharu, and Eevee moment. What will this Pokemon evolve into? Let's talk about it in the review portion that will start here in just a second. Alright, so when it comes to this episode of Chloe and the Pokemon Circus, I mean, it had some really good moments in it. It seemed definitely like a nice slice of life episode. Um, yeah, I thought this was a great episode. Um, as far as a rating, I'm gonna give this one seven out of 10. It wasn't that bad. It just wasn't anything too crazy. They could have added maybe a little bit more something else to it. It was still fun to see Ash and Go participate and have their shine as well. Now, of course, the main focus here is what will Eevee's Kohar or Koharu's Eevee evolve into and I'm pretty sure it will be nothing it won't evolve into anything and at this point in time the only evolution or evolution we need to see next I'm pretty sure is Sylveon which could be saved for a potential Serena return let me know in the comments down below if you think it's gonna happen and let me know your absolute rating for the episode I give it a 7 out of 10 it's not that bad but it's also not that great but I'm here I'm curious to hear what you guys have to say. So let me know in the comments down below. Again, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like on the video, share the video out, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys all for watching, and uh, bye.